My favorite project that I've ever worked on is my latest short film, Ovum. It's a Black Mirror-esque episode on what would happen in the near future to women if VR technology and reproductive rights continue on its current path and converges. Um, I love that project because this was all me. You know, I was the director, I was the writer, I was the producer. There was no one else telling me what to do, no client that I had to meet the demands of. And so it was just a creative playground and exercise for me. And at the same time, if anything went wrong, it was all my fault. But, <laughs> you know, there's uh, there's nothing better than making your own film and seeing it come to life. I created it as a response to everything that I was seeing happening in our society. I like to tell stories that are very connected to our real world and real world sciences and technology and also issues that women have to deal with. Ovum has been on the festival circuit for a little under a year now and has done really, really well picking up um, lots of awards across the country. I am really grateful for all the festivals that it has played because that's what I wanted to do with the short. I wanted to spark conversation. I wanted people to watch it and engage with it. And it's been really rewarding to sort of see all the discussions that come out of this little sci-fi short. Production for Ovum was actually relatively short. It was only three days. And then, of course, the pre-production process took months, um, not including the writing and the development. And then the post-production took about uh, two to three months. If you want to watch the film, you can go to its website, ovumshort.com.